One of the other differences between the 11 to 20 charger uh, kit build and the uh, 05 to 10 build is this rear quarter panel area behind the rear tire. So I've put in the mold a little uh, shape on where the 2015 and later parking light uh, can bond in. Now instead of just sticking it on there, keep the inner plastic piece from the old uh, charger rear bumper cover. And you can see I kept the top edge where the bolts uh, go. I kept the edge so that I can bolt this thing up with this 10 millimeter bolt that's here from the factory. So I can bolt this up underneath this whole thing, this piece that I saved, does more than just mount the light. You can see here's the, there here you go, here's the light. The light goes right in there. You can space it out an eighth of an inch if you wish to have it flush like the original. Remember, this is an eighth of an inch thick. Or you can leave it as it is, bond the whole thing under here, bolt it up and panel bond the edge, you know, slide it underneath here, and that keeps all of these factory inner wheel liner mounts intact. And that's what I like. If you're doing a wide body kit, you don't need the light uh, cut out because you're going to be putting this light on the outside of the fender flare. And those earlier 11 to 14 cars, if you run the wide body kit, you're going to need the 11 or the 15 to 20 uh, running light that you know, mounts on the back of the wheel. So keep these mounts for sure. You're going to use, especially this little bottom piece, see how I cut it off? You're going to use this to mount the wheel well inner liner just makes for a much quicker build.